Hi, everyone. Today, we are going to discuss the Affiliated Business Arrangement Disclosure. This is in both the CMIC Team Listing Loop and the CMIC Team Sales Loop. <clears throat> Excuse me. So from a listing perspective, this is a form that is required by our market center. Whether you sell a house or list a house, we do not get paid. Remember, the two forms that are required by Keller Williams Greater Metropolitan are the ABA, this is otherwise known as, and the home warranty, whether your client is accepting it or waiving it. So those are two forms. So this is one of the forms that we're going to go over today. So you're going to put two, the seller's names. I'm going to start with the seller. And you're going to put the property address. And you're going to put today's date. And they're going to sign the bottom. You are basically just disclosing the fact that we are affiliated with Ohio Real Title. And in our loops, it's called the ORT ABA, the Ohio Real Title Affiliated Business Arrangement Disclosure. Okay, that's it for the seller. If by chance on your listing, the buyer's agent says, who would you like to use? And your seller has the choice and they want to go with Ohio Real Title, the buyers then would sign this side. OK, so the sellers would sign it when you take the listing and then the buyers are going to sign it if that's the title company of choice. OK, now let's put the buyer hat on. You're the buyer's agent and now you represent the buyer. The buyer's names are going to go up here again, a required form in every transaction that we use besides just for the. Listing in the sale, it's required by Keller Williams Greater Metropolitan to get paid two forms, again, the ABA and the home warranty, whether it's accepted or waived. So with your buyer's hat on as your buyer's agent, your buyer's names will go here, the property address, today's date or the date in which you were writing the offer. Your buyers are going to sign it, okay? Just acknowledging that we have an affiliation with Ohio Real Title and they talk about the charges in the center here. <clears throat> excuse me and if by chance the seller says and in the terms of the purchase agreement you're going to use erie title emerald title uh, mickless title i'm making that up any other title company other than ohio real title the seller would not have to sign this form okay again let me repeat that if the buyer puts in the offer and you choose to use another title company other than ohio real title the seller doesn't need to sign this you may have to sign the seller's ABA, their agent's ABA. Uh, when I say ABA, that stands for Affiliated Business Arrangement. This is just disclosing the fact that we are affiliated with Ohio Real Title. Okay? The, we, as in the Colleen Mickles team, we get shares quarterly. I am an invested shared partner in that. And so we have to disclose this. Again, to repeat myself for the third time, the two forms of Keller Williams Greater Metropolitan that must be handed in with all deals are your this one, the ORT ABA, and the America's Preferred Home Warranty, whether you've accepted it or that your client has accepted it or waived it. Okay? Hopefully that's helpful. And we will um, discuss this further. If you need any other questions, just give me a call.